Giga i24. What is the project? So Giga i24 is the Gekai brainchild. 24, yes. It's the brainchild of mm -hmm. Rafał, Mikołaj, Piotr and Swabek. The idea is that we want a publication that can introduce the Polish market to potential American investors. As an American investor, it's very difficult to find good information mm -hmm. about the Polish market, Polish companies. Uh, and so we think that this can actually fill a gap in the market mm -hmm. and, uh, and provide these American investors the opportunity to learn, one, about the separate industries that GKI works in. So we have manufacturing, we have infrastructure, we have property development, we have hotels, we have e-commerce and retail. This covers such a wide width, breadth of, of all these different industries that any investor, if they want to find out how does the Polish economy look, how does it compare to America, mm -hmm. they can come to GKI24 and they can learn what they need to know. Hopefully, they'll come and they'll want to invest directly in GKI24. Yes. So what will be your role in that project? So I have three key, key functions. The first is simply to introduce the Polish market to American investors. Mm -hmm. As mentioned, it's very difficult to find good information about the Polish market. And since there's so much information about the American market, it's time for us to bring the Polish market yes. up to that, the level where you, where you can find with the American market. So that's number one. Number two is actually introducing GKI to American investors. As we would say in English, it's GKI. So we want American investors to see how GKI functions, mm -hmm. how similar it's run to American enterprises. And uh, the final piece is going to be really observing both the macro and micro elements that affect Poland. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about political events, we're talking about monetary policy, fiscal policy uh, that, can, that is going on in Poland. And then on a macro scale, where does Poland fit in the global economy? Mm -hmm. Because all these things matter very much for an investor mm -hmm. who's interested in looking uh, to Poland for a potential diversification opportunity. What can uh, be the most interesting thing in GKI for American investors? Well, I think the most interesting thing is actually how similar uh, these companies in Poland are run. You know, when you look uh, as an American or if you look as a foreign investor um, to a market outside of your own, you may wonder, okay, well, the regulatory uh, mm -hmm. landscape is very different, which means that maybe it's very difficult for me to invest in, as for instance, as an American in Poland. Um, but the thing is, it's, it's actually very easy. I mean, the American tax code uh, provides for, for great incentives to invest in Poland. Mm -hmm. And so I think from an American perspective, actually looking at uh, these Polish companies and reading about them, they'll find that, wow, this is a really attractive opportunity for me. Polish companies, by American standards, tend to be very undervalued. And so American investors can come in, they can look, and they can say, wow, this mm -hmm. is a market that I need to enter. How do you feel in Poland? I obviously feel great mm -hmm. in Poland. My dad's from Poland. I spent my summers growing up in Poland. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's a second home for me. And it's actually very nice to be working with GKI24 mm -hmm. because now I can actually marry my personal interest of Poland mm -hmm. and being Polish uh, with, uh, with work and, and trying to find actual efficiencies and, and a use case um, to, make, uh, to make Poland uh, you know, as, as uh, efficient as possible and as attractive as possible for American investors.